This tutorial is all about setting up memberships inside the Court Reserve platform. To set up a membership in Court Reserve, click the Memberships option from the Admin menu. In this tutorial, you can see that I have set up four individual memberships and two family memberships. Family memberships are great for organizations that want to have multiple people in the same household that share a membership at one set price. Let's take a closer look at setting up an individual membership. To view or update the details of a membership, simply click on the membership name. Let's click Seasonal Membership. This first screen is where you will set up some general information about the membership, including the name, description, effective membership dates, and valid purchase dates. As you can see here, the seasonal membership is effective from January 1st, 2020 to December 31st, 2020. I have it set up to be available for purchase on 11-1-2019 and set it to be no longer available after January 31st. This setup allows you the ability to give your members the ability to pre-purchase a membership for the following calendar year. It's important to note that if you never want the membership to expire, you can simply leave the membership start and end dates blank. This is great for free memberships or ongoing memberships that do not run on an annual basis. In this tutorial, I'm going to cover the first two tabs. The other tabs are covered in another tutorial video on setting up rules and restrictions. Let's click the Membership Price tab. This is where you will set the pricing structure for the membership. Core Reserve supports multiple payment options, including monthly, quarterly, yearly, and even a custom option. This section is where you can also set a one-time initiation price when a membership is purchased for the first time. You can also set a grace period for membership payments. For example, if I were to set it to five, then a member would have five days once a billing cycle is due before their account would be automatically deactivated. Next, let's look at how you would assign a new member a membership from the admin side. I'm going to do a quick member search. In this example, let's look up Pete Sampras. Then I'll click the membership tab to view Pete's current membership status. The first thing you will notice here is that Pete has no membership, so let's assign him one. I'm going to assign him the full membership and actually make it current as of 11-1, but set his next payment date to be 12-1. So now you can see in the details that Pete is now a full member and his next billing date will be on December 1st. Now as an admin, you can see that the first billing cycle has been generated with the option for you to collect payment if you wish. It's important to note here that Court Reserve will auto-generate the next billing cycle five days before the next one is due. Next, let's look at how you can pre-purchase next year's membership for Pete. Simply click the Change Pre-Purchase Membership button to pre-purchase a membership. In this example, I'm going to choose the seasonal membership that I previously set up that runs January 1st, 2020 through December 31st, 2020. You will notice that the membership start date will default to be the effective date of the membership automatically if an effective date has been preset on that membership. Simply review that the correct subscription type, aka payment schedule, is correct and then click assign membership. Notice now the current billing detail screen has a new row that shows upcoming membership with a link to the new membership that has just been pre-purchased. If you want to accept payment for the membership, simply click Pay. If you make a mistake, simply click Cancel to delete it. Now let's take a look at how your members can purchase membership plans through the Member Portal. To access memberships in the Member Portal, members would need to go to My Profile, then click Membership. From here, members can view their current and upcoming memberships, pay for existing memberships, cancel their current membership, and even pre-purchase future memberships. Members can also easily enroll in auto pay and view their current and previous billing cycles. 
Let's walk through an example of a member pre-purchasing an upcoming membership for next year. As a member, I would simply click the pre-purchase membership button. Next, a member could review all the memberships available for purchase and choose the one they are interested in. Next, the member would select an available subscription type, then click the pre-purchase button. The member is then directed to the transactions detail screen where they can pay for their membership. And that's all there is to it. Remove the burden of using an outside system to manage your memberships and let Court Reserve make this a whole lot easier for you, your staff, and your members. Check out more great tutorials of the Court Reserve platform by visiting courtreserve.com.